You're a driller. We are. Now, you're not going to drill very much if oil is at $60 a barrel because you can't make a dime. We can make money, and, and, and still a lot of areas of the United States are still profitable at 60 But the marginal areas. That, that's um, true. We've got you know, the Permian Basin, for example, is a great example of where we can drill for oil at even $50. Texas. That's Correct. Texas. In Texas, right. So right. the Bakken is creating some trouble now in North, North Dakota. North uh, Dakota, where we have the deduct for transportation and such. So infrastructure right now is key. We, in Texas, we've got a lot of good infrastructure, a lot of good pipelines, so we can drill for oil cheaper than some other areas part of the country. Am I right? in saying, though, that there's been a real pullback in drilling activity, exploration activity, yeah, long-term capital projects. I mean, the Financial Times this morning in London, they're saying, hey, there's a real pullback here. I think it, Tens I, of billions of dollars not being invested. I think, I think it's coming. You can't start and stop oil deals on, on a dime. We can't just stop drilling tomorrow, and we can't start stop drilling tomorrow as well. So I think that if oil remains where it's at, range bound at 60 or drops below 60, we've tested 60 now multiple times, we're still holding above 60, I think the slow down will occur. How long is the real key, though?